This is a quick video demo for uh, my 1970s Fox Power Machine um, Boost that's made out of a Maxwell House coffee can lid. So, And I've got the back off so we can kind of look into the circuit. There's just one single uh, transistor in here. It's a GE. I don't know the, the number on it. Uh, four resistors, two capacitors, and that's it. Um, two switches, an overdrive, an on and off, and then a knob. So it adds a lot of bass. Um, and it sounds pretty good. I'll just go through it. This is my dry, clean table. <laughs> through a telecaster on the bridge so um, we'll turn the overdrive off this is just the boost on sorry it's shaking the camera I'm playing through uh, Tone King Comet 40 uh, treble and bass are at right at 5 and the volumes at 2 so here's the pedal the Bypass Back on. And then the boost is adjusted. Down. And it does color your sound. It's definitely not true bypass. Here's with the overdrive on. Signal without it. Again, with the pedal on, full blast. It adds a lot of bass. Um, so I, I figured out that it stacks really well with, with overdrives that on the treble. So this is just the SD1. When you add the fox into it. So it's like a, it's just two blocks away, so that's why you're hearing that. That's on the neck pickup. Again, just the pedal by itself. Sorry, the uh, coffee can lid by itself. Um, it is a pedal that connects directly into your guitar, um, but I have a Telecaster, so it doesn't. Plus, I wouldn't want this sticking on my guitar. Um, it, it's kind of turned into like an always-on pedal. It just sounds good. It just has some nice... Uh, just like the beginnings of wooly fuzz tones. And then when I dial it back. You can hear it kind of break up on that look. Super overdrive with the drive nearly all the way off the level, and then the tone is uh, more towards the treble side to give it a nice mix. Very cool pedal. Here's what it sounds like when it's off. Um, Again, I live really close to a radio station, and uh, I think I'm going to fabricate a uh, a metal uh, aluminum 
um, back panel for this to kind of shield a little bit better. But it's it's made with a coffee can lid, so and once you turn your volume up, it it kind of helps a little bit. Again, um, it just adds a lot. Adds a lot of bass. Um, again, here's what my signal sounds like without it. Drive on and the boost on. 